Vinay, can you tell us more about uh, Convio's background and how it's developed over the last 10 years? Sure. So um, Convio is a leading provider of constituent engagement solutions for nonprofits. It's a, a platform that encompasses uh, all of the different elements that a nonprofit organization needs to communicate, engage, fundraise, and um, really excite its, its constituency, its supporter base. Uh, I started the company 11 years ago uh, with the epiphany that organizations not only needed affordable access to uh, web-based technology and that the software as a service or cloud-based model or ASP model as it was known back then would really be a, a great fit for our sector, but also that uh, at the time a lot of uh, nonprofits had uh, very siloed systems. Uh, they had one tool for email, one tool for advocacy, one tool for content management, one tool for fundraising, maybe another tool for e-commerce. And the challenge of that was it, ported, it created a very poor uh, supporter experience on the web. And secondly, it made it incredibly hard to actually understand insights and intelligence about your supporter base. Um, there's a big kind of uh, strategy shift in our industry to creating more seamless and thoughtful supporter journeys. Well, that's very hard to do that if your systems are in silos. And so 11 years ago, I set about to build uh, an integrated web marketing platform for charities. Uh, where we decided to unite all of these different components, online fundraising, content management, email, peer-to-peer -peer fundraising, etc., in one common platform unified by a single database and providing a single point of integration to traditional legacy donor databases. Um, we spent the first eight years of our existence really focusing just on doing that, being the very best possible at, at solving that problem and have established a very strong position in the U.S. charity market now, serving about 1,400 charities, 27 of the top 50 charities by revenue use our technology. Um, three years ago, we decided to enter the donor management space. We were a large enough company where we felt we could tackle a second uh, big challenge. Uh, and frankly, we were excited about the potential that Salesforce.com offered for us to build uh, donor management capabilities on top of. Uh, it's a very open and flexible and extensible platform that had internationalization capabilities, mobile capabilities, and we inherit all of that by building on top of their platform. And we've built uh, a donor management CRM system that supports events and volunteer management on the Salesforce platform and now have about 400 clients on that platform as well. Um, I've been looking at the UK market for a number of years. How would I make yes. it first eight years ago uh, on one of my trips back to the UK? I Although I may not sound like it anymore, I'm a Brit, I have a British passport, I grew up here, so I've been excited to come back to the market. But for several years, I didn't think the market was ready. Yeah, so, uh, so why now? The, the market feels really ready at this point. Um, the interviews I did just uh, back in February uh, with about 20 organizations uh, really confirmed that there is a thirst right now for uh, an integrated web platform. Uh, people are struggling right now with their point tools. Uh, many of those point tools are not that robust. Uh, we believe there's a cap uh, an opportunity to bring both more robust capabilities and most importantly, more integrated capabilities to the UK charity market to help them build better donor relationships, to help them build better loyalty, and to drive uh, more uh, fundraising results ultimately. We also think the cloud-based um, or software as a service-based model makes a great deal of sense. A lot of technology here in the UK, particularly in the donor management space, is still installed or legacy type technology. And we think the cloud model uh, will drive a lot of economic value to nonprofits. And Martin, how do you think that digital, uh, that Baton Digital fits into this, this development? Well, it's been our experience from the 50 charities that we now <coughs> serve that there are some real key needs. And, and certainly we see in the UK charity sector a lot of move across to the cloud and some of the incumbent sort of traditional providers here are trying to catch up with that. But we were quite excited to find a company that had produced these products from the ground up as cloud solutions. But I think the biggest thing that we're looking to do here is to solve the big problem that charities have. The, most, the one we spend the most time talking about is that of integration. How do I make sure that a donor I capture in System A can actually be picked up when they contact us via System B? And that's the biggest problem charities have to crack and probably their biggest opportunity that we're able to address through this uh, Convio partnership. There, and the reason we, we got really excited about Beige, and I met Martin um, a year ago, I'd heard of his company for several years, um, but when we came to the market, we wanted to come in really properly with a local feel, 
with local market intelligence. We need to localize that technology. There are some things that are different about the UK fundraising market, gift aid being a key mm -hmm. one. Um, and we wanted to work with a team that had a good reputation, was established here in the market, and, and could help us be the, the local firm. Um, and so what uh, our aspiration here collectively is to bring the best of breed technology from North America to the UK market, but make sure it really works for the UK charity market and make sure that we're able to serve clients in the way that they uh, should be served, which is with a local market presence, uh, with support, with account managers, with project managers here on the ground. Um, and uh, we think that the combination of those two elements will, will serve our client base the most effectively. Okay, Vinay and Martin, thank you very much.